Well, it looks like it's time for another player review, but this one is a little bit special. I'm fucking shaking. I'm fucking shaking. And so, yeah, unreal, unreal luck for me. I decided to keep my awards from the previous Foot Champs, and I just opened them. It was literally Monday morning at like 8 a.m. I, I was up really early. I was like, fuck it. Opened them, I got that. My girlfriend was with me as well. I was freaking the hell out. But yeah, this card is unreal. It's the massive, massive Belgian from Manchester City. Arguably the best player in the Premier League. In my opinion, he is the best player in the Premier League. Um, and with those stats, can you really disagree? 99 rated, he's in the 90s club with 5-star weak foot and 4-star skills. Quite tall as well. Uh, I decided to play him um, in cam for a majority of the games, but I actually preferred him as a box-box midfielder in a 4-2-3-1, like a CDM spot. Uh, I'm going to put up his stats here and you can... You can bring him up and you can pause pause the video to see it. But he is just unreal. Every aspect of his game, he is so, so good. Like, he's just, he's a joke. He's a sick joke. He's always got contributions from my sides. I'm not going to lie. I played pretty shit. I didn't have him in the greatest team. It was that team that I was using there. I was trying to get Jimenez and Perez at that point just to get the, the challenges done. But... I preferred him as a CDM or a centre mid because of his 90 defending. His defending was so dope. Honestly, this guy would would just intercept every ball and score and then just go forward from it and create so many chances. He's so tall, wins every header. Uh, the only little negative I had about him was sometimes like when he was sprinting, um, his acceleration wasn't there. I don't know if that's because of his height, so he's not like Ben Yedder's kind of format. But overall, nothing wrong with this guy. Literally, like... His positives are everything. I can't say anything else. He's one of the best cards ever on any FIFA, for that matter. I will say a negative is that once he gets tired, he gets really bloody pink. You know, he just gets too pink, and it, it's it's a bit shit in that sense. It kind of, I don't know, it kind of just shows how realistic the, you know, EA made the game this year. Oh, oh, he just well. handballed outside the box. What the fuck? But anyways, uh, overall, another positive is that he's just... You know, he's just so good. I don't know what else to say. As you can see by the goals, his dribbling is so good. He keeps the ball always close to his feet. He feels like like not a FIFA 20 player in that way. So his touch is always good. He never messes it up. I think, personally, has an average player skill level-wise. I feel like I focus too much trying to give the ball to him all the time. That's why he didn't score as many all the time. Because it made me very predictable to defend against. Uh, but overall, if you play him in a better team, he is so, so good. Um, I will say, though, another positive is that he's not winning the league, I guess. So, you know, I'm not a Liverpool fan, but I've just got to say that it's always good to see someone different win the league. It's always good. It's always good. Anyway, guys, for my final verdict, I will say to this player a 9.2. The reason why 9.2, I just think that for the coins that you do pay for him, he is unreal, don't get me wrong. But as a player myself, that I don't just have 3.8 or 4 million uh, to the side to just spend I feel like you can use 4 million to make a, a more compact team if that makes sense um, Overall my main thing is my quote for him is just let him talk because Otherwise, he'll get annoyed and probably this guy himself from the club Hope you guys enjoyed that video I'm trying to make these videos not just so much about me talking about the player a bit more similar to my funny moments and the top five goals of the week that I've done in the past so a little bit more comedy to it uh, I am I am streaming a lot more often now I'll be streaming foot champions this weekend probably 20 games on Friday like I did last time uh, and also if you want to see updates on any videos or when I'm streaming just hit me up on Twitter uh, And that's pretty much it guys. I hope you enjoy that if you like that you'll get a complimentary BJ and see you guys later